right, so let's see what love messages your person has. I'm such in a love mood. I don't know why. And this stream don't want to stream today. But I'm in a love mood. And I'm sensing that some people, y'all, been waiting on love, wanting love. Baby. Okay. That's okay. Sometimes it be like that, y'all. So we're going to see what whatever person that is on your mind, what do they have to say, y'all? What they got to say. Let's see. Ooh, excuse me. Okay, I'm seeing judgment. Okay, let's see what's going on. Look, y'all, stop judging people. Can't judge a book by its cover. Stop judging people. Um, This person is saying, you know, I judged you. I judged you and I wasn't supposed to. You know what I'm saying? I thought that this was going to be a wham, bam, thank you, ma'am, and it wasn't, okay? Or a wham, bam, thank you, sir, and it wasn't. God is good. I finally see I can be happy, okay? Yeah, they judged you. They just thought you was going to be a fly by night. They didn't really think that you were going to be somebody that they could, you know, invest in. Um, part of this is because people were telling this person rumors about you and lying on your name. And this person thought you was a little whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh-huh. Yes, they did. They thought because you was fine or whatever that you just sleep with everybody. Um, that's not the case. You're you're a beautiful person. You don't have to do all of that. Um, but this person in in we, they have experienced a lot of people that were fine that they would just you know do them in like that. But that's not who you are. Your ex's mothers all no. Your ex's mothers are all karmics. They are your mother all over again. Okay, somebody, you know, you may have told this person about your ex's mothers and things of that nature. Y'all had in-depth conversation, you know, y'all had some deep conversation. And um, this person was like, you know what, it sounds like all of your ex's mama are just like your mama. So that's why they didn't like you. So just, you know, ex that out the way. That's what they saying, basically. Okay, so y'all had a conversation. Hold on, y'all. Y'all had a conversation. I feel like, like I said, there's some snakes in the grass that are always trying to get this person to not see you who for, for who you are, generational wealth. Um, generational wealth here, okay? But the generational wealth healing childhood wounds, I never thought I would because of you. Yeah. This person knows that y'all are coming into generational wealth together. They already know something about y'all just screams abundance to them. And they're healing their wounds right now, okay, because of you. You you are the person who did, who did that. Love is in the air with you, too. Because of you, they decided to, you know, heal. they like, hold on, I need to heal because, you know, I'm I'm projecting my issues on somebody else right now. You know what I'm saying? She has a stinky pinky pH balance off. Now, this person hasn't said this to you, but they thinking in their mind, why she don't smell like she smell, y'all? And this is what I'm getting. Be mad at the spirit, guys, okay? Um, it's because her pH balance is off, okay? She need a, she need a probiotic, okay? She need one of them. Throw that pH balance right on, you know, or get you... you Redeem yourself, okay? Redeem yourself, baby, about this stinky pinky. But anyway, <laughs> you know, this person wants to redeem themselves. They feel like they didn't give you a full-blown chance, okay? They feel like it's because of their issues they didn't give you a chance. I'm in love with your mind and spirit. Yeah, you have can't, you come into something. You, you have come or you came. I ain't got time for the grammatical corrections right now. You came in this person's life and you changed them immediately. Okay? It's like this person was like, "Whoa, you just you it was like you blew you blew it was fireworks in their mind. That's what I'm hearing. Going for wish fulfillment. Mhm. Mm they going for you. They coming for you because they feel like if I don't come for this person, if this is not going to, this ain't going to end well. I'm going to forever think about this person. I'm going to forever, you know, say what if, 
So I got to get rid of my wounds so I can go ahead and do what I got to do. This person wants you now. They just, player doesn't know if they want to stay or play. This was them at first. They didn't know if they wanted to stay or play because they were like, hold up. She fine. And he fine. But the last fine people I, the last five, five people I, fine people I had just didn't do me right. Okay, so uh, let me turn to the right. I ain't going over there. I ain't going over there. But they came over there anyway, okay? Learning to express myself in a healthy manner. That is what they're doing. They're learning how to express their self. Love is in the air actually came out. This is why. It's because love is in the air. They want to express them, themselves in a healthy manner because they know that's the only way that you're going to deal with them or, and that they can deal with you now because they are very, they were very broken. We both are in love. I can't deny it so one of y'all done told this person y'all in love and this person denied it or they ran from it or they hid from it or they just stayed silent and all of that um but once you you know you was like okay okay i'm gonna let you handle it whatever however you see fit once you did that this person was like, no, I can't deny this. We both in love. God gave me dreams about you, confirmed who you are. I need to change. You are who I need to change for, and it's happening. Look at it. Spirit is proud. Spirit is proud of this person because they was going to let you go now, and you were going to let this person go, but they got it together right in the nick of time. Oh, my goodness. No, they didn't now. Elope. Let's save our money and do something big together. This person said, look, babe, we can get elope. We ain't got to have all these folks at the wedding, all this money we spending on other people. Let's save our money. We can tie them, tie that knot, okay, at the courthouse or somewhere. Save our money and invest in the business. Invest in our big old honeymoon. Invest in another house or invest in whatever. This person was like, babe, we, we can think about that. We're going to spend ten to 20000 on a wedding. For what? Well, however much they spend on weddings, for what? You know what I'm saying? Now I give up. Time's up. See, I told you, before you start giving up or before this person start giving God is going to make it come together. New opportunity will set us up for life. This person's working on new opportunities, business plans. They trying to make sure that y'all stay up and they don't want. And if you're a feminine, they don't want you to work too hard. So that's why they're doing that. They like, baby, I already tired out here, okay? All I need, this type of man that all they need is for you to support them. You can do whatever you want to do, okay? Not not maliciously, but if you want to work and have your own business, whatever you want, you don't have to do it, but you can with this person, okay? This person said we're in separation right now. I know we're in separation right now. It's because of the things that I did. I didn't know how to give to you and to give to other parts of my life. I didn't know how to stop giving to other people that didn't mean me no good, but I had to separate from these people, and I had to do that, and I wanted to separate from you while I did that because I didn't want to seem like I was doing you a certain type of way. That's what I'm hearing. This person didn't want to, yeah, and they, it hurt them. They fight. They was fighting this feeling off like, I don't want to just stop talking to this person. Some just registered for me. Okay, I don't want to just stop talking to this person because without this person, I'm feeling anxiety. I'm feeling this. I'm feeling that. I don't want to just stop talking to this person because this is the love of my life. My, blah, the love of my life. This is the new love. I, I, I don't want to leave this person out in the cold, but I got to heal right now. I got to finish doing the healing in order for me to get where I want to be with this person. I can't just bring this person no, no anything. And I feel like anything right now. On the inside because of the losses that I took. I don't want to bring this person anything. I want to do it right. I know this is my fate. But I'm a little hurt right now. I'm a little damaged right now. And it's not this person's fault. I met them while that I met them while I was damaged. It's not their fault, but I'm I'm certainly not letting go. I'm hoping and wishing on a prayer that this happiness continues, okay? I'm not, I'm not. I'm not taking that this is an L. I'm not at all. I see the light and I'm going to bring this person the light, period. Hello. Hello, communication coming up and it's going to grow. 
It's going to grow. Opportunities coming y'all way. This person for real.